Before you receive your transplant, you will need to have a small flexible plastic tube called a central venous catheter surgically inserted into the large vein above your heart. This catheter will allow painless collection of blood samples and the administration of medications, blood products, marrow or stem cells before, during, and after transplant. Your BMT coordinator will arrange the date, time, and place for you to have your catheter placement procedure done. They will also provide information regarding pre-surgery requirements that you must follow. If you have any medication allergies, please let your coordinator know before surgery. The procedure for installing the catheter requires local anesthesia. For many patients, this is a relatively simple and painless procedure, although some do experience minor discomfort. After your catheter is put into place, a chest x-ray will be done. Pain medication will be available to help with any pain or soreness you may experience after the procedure. Your BMT team will also provide you with information regarding pain management if you should need it at home. You will be observed after the surgery for about one and a half hours. If there are no complications, you will be allowed to go home. Before you leave, a nurse will give you and your caregiver instructions on the required daily care for the catheter. It is important to keep the catheter and dressing clean and dry. You should avoid showering after the catheter has been put in until the area is well healed. We usually recommend sponge baths for up to one week. Do not go swimming or let the catheter go underwater in the bathtub. The oncology clinic nurse or the home care nurse will teach you and your caregiver how to change your dressing at home. We feel that you and your caregiver are the best people to take care of changing the dressing. The dressing will need to be changed within the first 24 hours from when the catheter was inserted, then once weekly and or when the dressing becomes dirty or damaged. You and your caregiver will also be taught how to flush the tube lines for daily maintenance. Remember to always keep the tubing taped to your chest wall to avoid accidentally pulling on it. During the course of treatment, the catheter site will need to be checked often for signs and symptoms of infection. If you develop a fever of 100.4 degrees Fahrenheit or higher, redness, swelling, drainage, and or increase tenderness at the site, you need to contact the BMT physician immediately for an evaluation. Your transplant team will provide you with the appropriate phone numbers to call if you have any immediate post-operative problems or questions regarding the catheter. Once you are done with the transplant and the BMT physician feels it's time to remove the catheter, your coordinator will call and schedule the removal and let you know the time and place.